Hey guys, MGH here, and welcome to some Dirt 3. <laughs> um, Alright, we're going to go Dirt Tour. I've started this game already, just so you guys know. Um, I picked it up earlier today for £5 on Steam. And a lot of people on Twitter were like, dude, the game's great, buy it. And I thought, you know what, for five quid, you can't go wrong. Dirt 3 is a game that I saw when it came out and thought, I've got to get this game, and I never did. So you can see I've won a few races already. We're just going to jump into one right here and play it live. I thought, why not make a video on it? Um, it doesn't necessarily mean that... Um, ooh, which one do I go for? We'll go with the 90s. It doesn't mean that this is going to be a series. It just might be every now and again I upload a video of me playing this. Um, there's a lot of offer here on offer, but I need to buy them tonight. Let's just go with this one here. So you can see objective bonus. I get 300 rep in the bottom right there for using this one. 200, 100, yeah. We'll go with this one, the Ford Escort. I mean, it's, it's a really good game. I'm not going to deny it, guys. I'm really enjoying it. Um, just so you know, though, I am playing on PC and I am playing with an Xbox 360 well, controller. So, yeah. Let's see another podium. We're in Finland. He wants me to hit the podium. I'm sure I can do that. I don't know what type of race this is. I think it's just a... Uh, I don't know. We'll see. So, gear race I'm going to put on slightly short. Downforce, uh, we'll go for high. Although, it's gravel 100%. So, I should probably go for... We'll keep it in the middle. Suspension soft. We want a higher height, uh, ride height. Uh, loose differential. And the brakes, I'm not too bothered about that. There we go. When you're on dirt, you want to raise the car just that little bit. It gives you a bit more clearance on the bumps and things like that. I mean, how many off-roaders do you see two inches off the floor? It's not much, is it? Here we go. And obviously, as you can tell, the graphics are insane. Here we go. My first race on YouTube. Lots of people say, we've seen you on FIFA. Are you as good at FIFA as you are at driving? <laughs> Wait, no, that's the wrong way around. Are you... As good at driving as you are at FIFA. There we go. Got it out that time. Oh, man. It is so addictive. Oh, go easy on the uh, acceleration there. If anyone's wondering what kind of driving assists I'm using, I'm using none. No driving assists whatsoever. All I've got is the racing line on the ground and um, the ability to set the car up myself, obviously, like you saw at the start there. Oh, God. Oh, I went a bit wide there. That was poor, Matt. But anyway, there's a very cool feature on this game. Very similar to the, um, the F1 2012 feature. If I press LB on my controller, I can rewind time. So if I have an accident, I can rewind and redo the corner. Um, you can do it five times in a race, I think, and sometimes ten. <laughs> uh, you can see in the bottom left, there's those arrows. Five of them. Okay, thanks for the instructions, dude. This is going well, though. Okay. Oh, fucking hell. That bridge was so close. There we go. Race one complete. One minute 22. Nice. I think I would have You're smashed them there. Four Let's seconds. Woohoo, yeah. Four seconds ahead. By the way, this game also has built-in YouTube capabilities. So if you want to upload something straight from the game, you can. I don't want to do that, obviously, because uh, I want to be controlling what I upload and editing it myself. Here we go. Race number two. Can I do the same? A four second gap, that was that was nice. Again, we're going to set up the vehicle. Um, the gear ratio, the longer you have it, the faster it will go, as in top speeds. The shorter you have it, the quicker you'll accelerate. So you've got to find, that is acceleration, that is top speeds. I like it about there for 100% gravel tracks, as you can see just above vehicle setup. Downforce, let's see what he has to say. Increasing the downforce improves the vehicle's grip when cornering, but can reduce its top speed. There you go, reduces top speed the higher it is, but increases your cornering ability, so we want that. Um, really isn't all about top speed rally, it's about cornering, right? Suspension, you want it soft, ride height, you want it relatively high, and that will keep the same. Here we go. Oh, I'm ready for this. This one's like a proper race, I've actually got people in front and behind me, just like a rally race in real life. Come on then. Look at that acceleration. One day I will go rally racing. I love driving my Suzuki Swift, but I'm sure it's nothing like driving on dirt. 
you know, I can drive on the roads and be a little bit speedy, I guess, but there's just, there's no comparison to something like this. I would love to give it a go. Ooh -wee. I wouldn't want to do this, well, at this speed, anyway. I'd like to go on this track in a car like this, but I would not want to do it at these speeds unless I was actually a professional at it or whatever. Because these corners here, they've got bumps just on the apex, the invisible apex, I should say. Um, and if you clip that at high speeds with the vehicle slightly on its side, there is no recovering from that. You are flipping that bitch. Give me some instructions, bitch. Come on. This is going well. Reached a speed of 95. Nice. Bit of handbrake there. Uh, just gone wide. That was not good enough, Matt. Not good enough. Hopefully I'm showing off that I do have driving skills as well. A lot of people don't know it because a lot of YouTubers don't upload racing games. They're not as exciting. Um, I am a very keen racing gaming guy. <laughs> I've bought all the Need for Speeds, Ridge Racers, all of that shit. I'm actually catching up with this guy. Um, I'm a massive fan of, you know, customising cars and stuff like that. There we go. Sweet. Um, like all the old Need for Speeds. Absolutely loved them. There we go. Seven seconds ahead. Woohoo! That was good. But yeah, I, mean, I know I upload FIFA mainly and Far Cry and stuff like that, but I do love racing as well. 500, 600, 500. Ouch. Almost level 5. That was good fun, that. Can I just say as well, the menus and the music and the sound effects in this game, I want to say, actually, my favourite menus in a game ever. Turn around at the marker and come back again. Drifting as much as you can as you go. Right, we're doing drifting now. I haven't done any drifting in this yet. Drift showcases uh, take you to sideways down familiar point-to-point -point routes. Wow. Race down the stage, turn around at the marker, and then head back up, scoring as many drift points as you can along the way. All right, I've never done this before, so this should be uh, this should be interesting for you guys because I'm probably going to suck it at first. Cool music as well. Right. Welcome to Michigan. Thank you. Views up here near the great... I'm ready. I'm so ready for this. I'm, I'm pumped. Five pounds for this game. Honestly, absolute bargain. Although, as you're watching this, it's probably gone. <laughs> you won't be able to buy it for that cheap. Um, although I will tweet about it as I finish recording to let you guys know. Right, so drifting is going to be all about cornering. So gear ratio, I want short. Downforce, we want very high. Suspension, we want it. Let's have a look what he says. Increasing the suspension stiffness improves cornering. There you go. Increases cornering if it's stiff. There you go. We want low ride height and differential. We want strong. Let's see what he says about that again. A strong dip encourages oversteer, making power sliding easier. There you go. Stronger it is, the easier it will be to power slide. Right, it is time to do some drifting for the first time. I'm in a different view to help me see where the car is. Let's see how many points I can get here. Oh, that's a good start. Come on. Oh, no. No, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Sound like I'm doing a dump. Uh, <laughs> almost 4,000 points so far. Not too bad. Oh, my God. Going too fast. It's so good. It is so, so good. It feels really realistic. Oh, that wasn't good. Let's go ahead and rewind that. I get to show you the feature. Look at that. Then you can press play like that and it restarts you there. Oh, I get no points for that. That sucks. And when you lose air as well, if you're in the air, you lose, lose the drifting points that you're getting. That sucks. Donkey dick, that does. Oh, and I'm going to have to rewind that as well. <laughs> First time, though. You have to give me a break, guys. Oh, I oh, just managed to avoid that. Nice. Oh. Surely that's it. Yes, platinum. On my first go, I get platinum. Gotta love it. I tell you what though, that is <clears throat> that is definitely difficult, more difficult than I was expecting. But um, I'm pretty proud of that. First drift on the game, and I got platinum. There you go. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. 200 rep for that. 
Medal bonus. Oh, yeah. Right, okay. Let's go to the next one now. This is a county loop four laps. Right. We've got 520, 555. Five. See, I get more rep bonus if I win with this, so I'm going to go with that one there. Rep is everything, I'm guessing, at when you're lower levels because it's going to help you rank up and unlock new things, so that's what we'll go for. But honestly, I'm really enjoying this game. We're at the smelter. This this map's awesome. Or this track, I should say. So we are... It says bonus. Win and lead by one second. All right. Got to win by one second. This is a proper race, by the way, guys. So there's other cars. Same area as me. It's going to be tight. And that is what she said. And you've got to have the cockpit view when you're racing like this. You have to. Even though I'd argue it is easier without. It's easier using the big... Oh! My god. Oh my god. Right. Whoa. Okay. We're going to rewind this. Because what I did there was not good. It's part of learning maps. Right. I'm just going to hang back at this bit. I'm going to slow down a bit. Oh my god. It did it again. Let's um, <laughs> rewind one more time and slow right down. Or do I power through it? I reckon it's my positioning there. All right. I love that. That's so cool. Oh my... What the fuck? I wasn't expecting that to happen. Right, okay, another time. <laughs> there we go. Bit of rain there. Uh, not rain, puddle. Bit of wilder. There we go. That's more like it, Matt. I've got four laps of this, so they'll get faster as I go, because I'll start learning the, the corners and stuff. Oh, okay, that's a corner, not more road. Fuck you, motherfuckers, get out of my way. Oh, look at that. Look at that drift. Oh, oh that's a tight corner. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, yes. We are first already. So I've got to win by one second. I think I can do that. That is very difficult to see through that. And isn't it weird without cars ahead? You just all of a sudden have no idea where you're going. And there's no guys give no guy giving me instruct instructions in the uh, passenger seat. Oh god. Great car though. It is very nice handling. Oh, look at that. It's so 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 satisfying when you pull off a great power slide like that. Same here, hopefully. Oh, look at that. I did leave the driving line a little bit there, but that's all right. How far ahead of these guys am I? Two seconds, last lap. Or is it? No, there's two more laps, I think. Come on. Get, oh, that bit is awful. I need, to, I need to work on that bit. I need to cut inside just a little bit quicker than that. Right, remember, this is a left... Oh, the difference in gravel and concrete is so, so, so much. When you join, when you rejoin the track, it's a little bit, it throws you off because you're expecting there to be more grip when suddenly there isn't and your car goes flying off. Oh, concrete. Oh, it's so nice. I'd like to do a drifting competition on this track. That'd be pretty awesome. Right, last lap, guys. Here we go. Let's do this corner properly for the first time. I still did it again, didn't I? Yeah. You need to go wider. All right, next time I come on this track, we'll get it get it right next time. Whether you'll see it, I don't know. Because like I said, I don't plan to make this a series. It was just a bit of fun. That was not good. I'm going to go rewind that. That is just... It is awesome. I wish there was more games that had something like that. This is such a good idea. Racing games are... They are great fun, don't get me wrong, but they can be the most frustrating because if you fuck up one corner after three minutes of driving and you have to restart, it is beyond annoying. So they've clearly looked at that problem and thought, right, what can we do to solve that? I know, let's include a rewind feature. Brilliant! <laughs> and there we go, we win. Beautiful race, Matt, beautiful race. 
Nice. I'd say you're ready to tackle the next dirt tour event. Ooh, next dirt tour event. All right, sounds good. Let's move on to the next race then.